Using product method of charging interest from drawings, calculate interest at the rate of 12% per annum where the partner withdrew rupees 5000 on May 1 and 10000 on October 1 for the year ended March 31. Okay. Now this question is exactly the same as the one which we had taken in the previous version. If you haven't gone through it, you can go through it. For calculating interest on drawings using simple method. In this case, you are told to find out the interest using product method. In product method, the procedure remains the same. So what happens is, first you see what was the date when the drawing was made. In our example, we did it on May 1. For how much? The amount was 5000. Right? Then on October 1, we did another drawings for 10,000. Right? So if you see this timeline, you did a drawings on May 1, you did a drawing on October 1 and your year ends on March 31. So what's the time gap between these two? Six months. From here to here, 10 months. Right? So this money I used for 10 months and this money I used for 6 months. Till here the details are same, everything is same. In product method, what happens is we find out the product of amount and the time period. Right? The time period. The time period can be in months, it can be in days. Right? In this case, it is in months. Then what we do is we find out the product which is equal to the amount into months. Or the days as the case may be so 10 into 5000 gives you 50,000 6 into 10,000 gives you 60,000 right find out the product as step 1 step 2 we find out the sum of these two products 110,000 right no rocket science just find out the simple sum for these two right as step 3, what we do is, on this product, which is 110,000, we find out the interest, okay? What is the rate of interest? It's 12 upon 100 for one month. One month. If the denomination is in months, you find it for one month. If it is in days, you find it for one day. Right? Now if we knock this off, these two goes off here, 12, 12, 1, 1100. So my interest on this amount is 1100, right? If I just take you back to the previous example, here also using simple method, what I got was 500 plus 600 is equal to 1100. So what it shows is that in respect of same data using the same numbers the interest calculated both by using the product method or the simple method is same right there's no difference in out here right you can watch out for more videos and accounts for partnership account for company accounts for issue of shares debentures and all at iadubook.com it was nice having you today. All the very best for future videos. Thank you.